Glamour, literally, in the dictionary, means to use uh, visual stimulus to seduce. That is probably quite seductive to anyone who's blind. I think in braille terms, that's quite horny. That looks like a set from some ghastly daytime Australian soap opera. <laughs> How is that glam? Do you know what? Move it's on. understated, mate. It doesn't have... Sorry? What it, is this word? It's understated. What? Understated? understated yes. What is this word of which you speak? Understated glam. Right, boys, next one. Okay. Next slide. I think that's the kind of colour that manic depressives see before they throw themselves over a ledge. Look, I mean, that's two old people sitting waiting to die, you know, with their <laughs> rugs over their knees. Mate, I think you're being a little harsh. Strangers. Glamour. Um, talk to me about this colour. Now, what's this colour? This colour is uh, a, a, a naughty grey. Naughty grey? Naughty grey. I would see that more as a very dark shade of disappointment, to be honest. <laughs> that, to me, doesn't say naughty at all. That says okay. school blazer. Talk to me about glamour now. I need a sentence that you think is going to be so compelling that I'm going to forgive you what you've done here. OK, well, our concept really begins with this woman. And what does she do for a job? She's actually a CEO of D her own company. She... This whole fiction that you've created. Yeah, she likes grey because she, she actually likes this understated sophistication. Right. Nothing to too mm. splashy, no, yeah. nothing too glitzy. So, she so nothing it. too glamorous? No. All right, see you in the judging. See ya. Uh, I, uh, I fear it. My eyes are sensitive instruments, you know, they're incredibly refined organs of judgment and design. I can't use them on that. <laughs> There's something innately wrong about all of that, which is that it's not balanced properly. There's too much on top of there, lose the rickshaw, and in mm. fact, I'd lose the candle as well. Actually, the red horse is a stroke of genius in that black and purple room. Red horse on the left-hand side, black telephone on the right-hand side. It's a completely yeah. balanced yep. tablescape yep. and yep. works really, really well. Yep. But that's after 250 years of experience as an interior designer at the top of my game <laughs> for all of the crowned heads of Europe. So, you know, you can't really expect Chelsea to be quite there on that one, can you? That, I thought, was lovely. Bear in mind, though, boys, it is going to explode, and some people like to sit on that wall, and you're going to get buried and lick your ass. Quite... <laughs> Pardon me, that sounds rather fun, actually. Um, I'm sure I've paid to have that done. The planting, I thought, was quite nice. They didn't have too much greenery, I felt. They you see, that didn't hurt at all, did you? You made a little plant comment, and you quite enjoyed it. I love it when you patronise me from your great height. Um, now, the opportunists. That was pretty. That rather cartoony wall on the right. Yeah, that's an excellent choice in terms of plant. I love the filigree on the wall. Yeah, they the, were the, the, fantastic. the panels were a wonderful idea. And the potocarpus on the left-hand side there with the little cloud You are pruning. making most of these up, aren't you? Tell no, me you I'm are. not. Really? I'm trying to teach you something, fish, you buffoon. <laughs> Quickly, soak it up. <laughs> I'm soaking. It's not all about wallpaper and so guilt and renaissance. Can you guest. come sit between us here? I'm so glad I'm the guest. I don't get the abuse. <laughs> yeah, we're being nice to you. And, oh, I need more renaissance. We're being nice more to you. More renaissance. I need some more Philly carpets. Or whatever it is. I wanted more like a savannah sort of yep. thing. I liked the sunset and my tree, but I didn't get the brown that I wanted just under the sun. So out of all the things you wanted, did you get more or less than you wanted? More. More? So you're still going to pay them? You're still going to give them the check. You, you know you have to pay them, don't you? And like millions yeah. and millions <laughs> oh, yes. of dollars. Yeah. Don't worry, them. Lawrence will lend you, you know, the money. It's fine, it's fine. If we could ever get his wallet open, he'd lend it to you. <laughs> Hasn't been open since 1962, you know? <laughs> right. I would say those wardrobe doors are a bit badly coloured yeah. in. There should have been another stronger colour in there. As a professional, I think you need to open up that colour field a bit we and have some We tried to brighter. get something there, but yellow, green and blue were probably pretty much all in the same family in the colours. Exactly. But we couldn't find any other colour that would sort of... I, know, she, she, I think she might have blown my cover there. Mate, I think she's on to you. Can we have well, a fast car waiting? Yes, mate. I've just been bumped off the series well, for Natalia. Um, how, would you, how would you feel about being head judge from now on? You can Excellent. grow a beard, can't you? Good. Yeah, yes. I'm sure I could. Yeah.